In this micro tutorial, we'll take a look at the Thor Polysonic Synthesizer. This godlike semi modular beast of a synth fuses the best parts from 40 years of synthesizer history into one device, letting you create any sound. From iconic synth lines of the past to futuristic mutated madness. From left to right, your sounds start with a sound generator, called an oscillator, passes through filters, and then makes its way through the amp before finally ending up in the effects section. On the way, you can use a wide variety of options to modulate your sound, like LFOs, envelopes, and a step sequencer. The basics are already connected, but Thor can do much more than this. Let's dive into each part. Thor comes equipped with six different oscillator types that you can use in any of the three oscillator slots. Want to recreate those classic analog synth sounds? No problem. Just load up an analog oscillator or two. With the classic waveforms used in subtractive synthesis represented, this is a great starting point for a wide range of synth sounds. Use three FM pair oscillators and instantly conjure up the sound of the 80s. Or try phase modulation for a wonderfully cheap sounding but useful tone. For even richer textures, sweep through a wavetable oscillator to find a sound loaded with character. Or go big with the multi-oscillator, a stack of detunable oscillators, the obvious choice for those huge floor-filling synths. Add a noise oscillator to the mix and dirty up your sounds. With five types of noise, you're never short on options. Then mix and match between the oscillators for unlimited sonic possibilities. And once you've found your sound, send it through Thor's four different filter types, each with its own sound and character. From the warm, low-pass ladder filter that rolls off the top of the sound and lets low frequencies pass through, to the near-human vowels of the formant filter. Shaping your sound is just a click away. When we say Thor is semi-modular, this means that the most important parts of the signal flow are already routed together. You can simply follow the arrows on the front panel to see the signal from start to finish. However, if you want to go deep, the modulation matrix is where the true potential of Thor lies. This gives you complete control over the signal flow, letting you modulate anything within Thor with, well, anything within Thor. It's super easy to set up as well. Just select a source, a destination, and what amount of signal to send. For example, you can use an LFO to control the filter frequency of filter 1. Use the mod envelope to sweep through the position of a wavetable oscillator. Or use the built-in step sequencer to both control the formant filter and sequence a great melody. Once you're done tweaking, embellish your sound with some extra width and bounce using the built-in delay and chorus. The possibilities for sound design in Thor are endless. But don't be alarmed. Thor ships with a wide array of patches to get you started and keep you inspired. From bread and butter bass synths to spaced out soundscapes, beautiful bells to retro keys, squeaky highs to low end rumble, Thor's got you covered. <laughs>